Hey there gearheads. Well, it's a rainy day here in Portland and the drags have been canceled. But we have more news of Big Chief's big move to NHRA and that includes something we touched on in our last vid. The Premier Streetcar Association and their anarchy at the Arch out in St. Louis. We showed you some of the badass streetcars that compete out at that event courtesy of Steve Carlton, one of their photographers out there. Now we had heard that there were a couple of uh, 405 list racer guys were going to show up out there. But what we didn't expect, compliments of Urban Hillbilly, was for Big Chief to show up out there with Cromod in tow. What with all the work they had to do to get the Cromod ready for NHRA tech. But he was there and he made passes. And we'll get into that later. Meanwhile, Urban Hillbilly brings us this one wild Camaro. Now this reminds me of a couple of years ago when I was talking to Kurt, who was trying to build the new Portland Speedway. Now this was one hell of a plan, a racing entertainment center. I had heard of some drag racing going on in some speedways back east. They were running something like 100 yard drags inside the oval. I push this as one of the many innovative events that could be done at this new facility. But alas, a wicked, wicked woman came and ruined all of that, at least for me. Anyway, the track was never built. And unfortunately, it appears that there will never be another racetrack built anywhere around funky Portland. But go see the wild urban hillbillies coverage of this speedway drag racing. It's really something. We'll bring in a clip for you later in this vid. Anyway, looky here. Big Chief went one round in the Crow Mod. Chief's final pass. <laughs> With a 423 at 172. He was racing in a class called Pro NOS versus Pro Boost. The, the Pro Nitrous versus uh, Pro Boost was won by Thomas Eddy in a Chevelle. The Fast Class was the Flying A Motorsports Outlaw Pro Mod, and that was for 10000 bucks, and that was won by Jason Scruggs in a 69 Camaro. He ran a 361 at 215. Okay guys, now be sure and like and follow. We've got something new every Thursday. Now here's something for you. Okay, continuing on, we have a crash to show you. Uh, Terry Barkley uh, in the Pro Mod Camaro. It's a hell of a crash out there. And uh, we'll show you a clip of that. So, we understand that uh, the following Monday, uh, Big Chief was testing the Crow Mod in a quarter mile for the first time and uh, making his uh, license passes for NHRA. Word comes back from Speed Society that he ran 6.42 at 2.23. And it is, seems that his chutes did not open and it appears that he may have played a little tag with the sand trap. But all in all, he's happy. That was good for his first pass. Now as far as getting the Crow Mod ready, uh, Big Chief posted a, a phone vid about what all that entailed and it's about uh, $40,000 worth of mods for all of the safety and tech requirements and uh, he's got a vid up there, go see it. <laughs> Fireproof shoot things, but it put a CO2 or activator cylinder on the parachute so that if I'm going down the quarter mile and I'm passed out from all the G-forces, they can hit their little box and it'll throw my parachutes and turn turn the car off and all that cool stuff. So that's safety, right? Everybody said I'm going to shit my pants when I go quarter mile. They're going to help me slow down. In other news, do you guys all remember Shane and his sidekick Bob? Well, the Blackbird Vega is coming back after his wreck. 
and it's bigger and badder than ever and he's saying yeah, maybe a top three contender on the list okay I want to give a shout out to Brazil our analytics are telling us there's a bunch of you tuning into our vids and we understand that it could be that you are watching last season uh, currently right now down there for the first time if you're from Brazil give us a shout so this was this uh, Waiko racing operation uh, Octane No Prep out at the Kansas Speedway and uh, yeah, they, they're going for five grand. Not too shabby. There was a car in that lineup of Gateway Racers that we just showed you that wasn't supposed to be in there. Did anybody notice which one it was? Trust me.